good morning student today in our english period i am going to start with the exercise portion of unit 1 as the explanation part of unit 1 is completed so now let's begin with the exercise portion of unit 1 so answer the following question from the who did patrick's homework it's given in page number 11 question 1 what did patrick think his cat was playing with what was it really answer 1 patrick thought that his cat was playing with a little doll it was in fact a very small sized man and elf question 2 why did the little man grant patrick a wish answer 2 the little man granted patrick a wish because patrick saved his life from the cat question 3 What was Patrick's wish? Answer 3. Patrick wished that the little man would do his homework for till the end of the semester. Question 4. In what subjects did the little man need help to do Patrick's homework? Answer 4. he needed help in english maths history even in all subjects question 5 how did patrick help him answer 5 he himself read all books for the little man question 6 who do you think did patrick's homework the little man or patrick himself give reason for your answer answer 6 i think patrick himself did his homework because he read all books and he was staying up nights working harder alf always shouted that he don't know about all subjects now a fill in the blanks in the sentences below with the words or phrases from the box so downside one box is given we have to choose proper word and fill the blanks you may not know the meaning of all the words look such words up in a dictionary or ask your teacher so now we start first we read that box out of luck mystery true to his word chorus semester between you and me look up one some people find household dash a bore but i like to help at home chorus two who stole the diamond is still a mystery this semester we are going to have a class exhibition four true to his word the elf begin to help patrick five can you look up this word in the dictionary six i started early to be on time but i was out of luck there was a traffic jam seven she says she's got a lot of books but between you and 
me, I think most of them are borrowed. Then turn to next page. In this page, B, use the clues given below to complete this crossword puzzle. So, clues are given downside, across and down. In this way, clues are given and we have to solve out this crossword puzzle. So, first, very tired. So, this meaning is given and we have to find out the word of this. So, one, very, then after two, had an angry look on the face. Scowled, three, short trousers, breeches, four, a fault in a machine that prevents it from working properly. It's given glitch. Five, a small and naughty boy, fairy. Fifth one, and it's given elf. See, all these words are in chapter. It's include in the chapter only. Then, six, work that must be done every day, often boring. Six one, it's a chorus. A basket, seven, a basket with a lid. Hamper, eight, gave a short high pitched cry. And eight one is shrift. So all these words are given in the chapter only. Then after come to the page number 16 poem part. Now answer the following questions. Do you agree with what the poet says? Talk to your partner and complete these sentences. 1. A house is made of non-living things like bricks, stones and hard wood. 2. It has many doors, glass windows, Roof, wall, courtyard, tile floors. 3. A home is made by the family members who stays in the house full of emotions, feelings, love, understanding and care for each other. 4. It has members of the family like mother, father, brother, sister, who love and care for each other. 2. Now complete the sentences about your house and home. 1. My house is a structure made of building materials like bricks, stones, Glasses, it contains door, windows, wall, roof, tile, floors. Then two. The best thing about my home is I live with my family members in my house. My mother, father, brother, sister, grandmother and grandfather we all love each other and care about each other. There is a no self-oriented activity but for all. So, this two question in that you have to write down answer of your own. So, it may be vary from student to student. So, students, you need one explanation of the story 
explanation of the poem it's completed today we complete exercise from the textbook now further we will continue in the next video you just revise once again read out how much we completed till then take care of yourself stay at your home stay sa safe be happy do little bit study thank you goodbye